Have you ever thought about the fact that there are billions of black holes in the universe that can change their position and then possibly come towards us? It sounds like sheer horror, but that is exactly what is happening now. The supermassive black hole in the galaxy PBC J2333.9-2343 has drastically changed its direction due to a mysterious event and is now coming directly towards us. Should we be worried now? A changing black hole. Most black holes are more or less fixed objects. Like our sun, they move through the galaxy, but they remain in predictable positions, much like our sun moves through the galaxy in a specific orbit. Researchers have now also discovered vagabonding black holes, and this can be terrifying. These black holes wander relatively freely and untethered through the universe, and at worst, one will eventually show up right on our cosmic doorstep. Black holes are largely invisible. They are conspicuous only by their gravitational attraction. Scientists are currently sure that the next black hole is about 1,000 light years away, but they can never be completely sure. We have not studied all phenomena in our galactic environment, and the performance of our telescopes is limited, especially when it comes to mysterious phenomena like black holes. This all sounds very uncomfortable already, but what if a supermassive black hole in the center of a galaxy suddenly turns around and comes towards us. That is exactly what has happened now, and we can only wonder what will happen in the future. The Strange Galaxy PBC J2333.9-2343 A team of international astronomers has discovered a galaxy that has an active supermassive black hole at its center. The processes at the center of this galaxy sound like pure horror. The black hole sucks up vast amounts of matter creating jets that reach far beyond the galaxy. The nucleus of the galaxy, PBC J2333.9-2343, is truly a voracious and deadly monster, but the black hole at the center of our own galaxy is harmless. Sagittarius A hardly sucks in any matter, nor does it exert a particularly dangerous gravitational pull. Now let's travel together to the center of the galaxy, PBC J2333.9-2343, and experience firsthand what's going on there. Imagine a black hole, a giant of nothingness, several million times larger than our sun. The black giant's accretion disk glows brightly as all material attracted by the black hole's gravity and accumulating in this disk reaches extremely high temperatures before falling into the black hole. These processes create jets, high energy beams of charged particles that travel at nearly the speed of light. These jets travel at incredible speeds through the galaxy and extend far beyond it into the interstellar medium. PBC J2333.9-2343 is a radio galaxy, which means that it emits very strong radio frequency emissions that come from the jets and their interaction with the surrounding interstellar medium. The tremendous energy converted inside the galaxy causes heating and excitation of the surrounding gas which drives shock waves throughout the galaxy and can lead to star formation processes. The jets cause the interstellar medium in the immediate vicinity of the black hole and within the galaxy to be compressed and extremely heated. All in all, these processes make the galaxy a rather uncomfortable place. In particular, stars that are close to the center or are hit by the jets have an uncomfortable life. It almost seems as if this galaxy produces stars in large quantities only to have them gobbled up again. This galaxy really seems like a horror, doesn't it? Let us now come to the part that can concern us. First of all, let's look at the question of whether the jets from PBC J2333.9-2343 can pose a threat to us. Here we can give the all clear, because despite the impressive energy and activity converted in PBC J2333.9-2343, the galaxy is too far away for jet streams to hit us. There was no danger to Earth thus far. The galaxy is millions of light years away, and even if radio emissions traveled those distances easily, they would not be a danger when they reached us. On top of that, PBC J2333.9-2343 was moving away from the Milky Way. But now, scientists have observed something at the center of this galaxy that is disturbing, even shocking the black hole and jets change direction. Change of direction of the jet. 
Can you imagine how a scientist feels looking at this blazer inside PBC J2333.9-2343 and observing the tremendous activity there? Everything seems far away, but then suddenly it happens and the jet turns its direction. Instead of streaming away from the observer, it turns 90 degrees and now points directly at the observer. Suddenly, the emission of the radio beam increases sharply, and it almost seems as if the observed galaxy has directed its beam at us to say, I've noticed you. Eerie, isn't it? The orientation of the jets toward us determines how a galaxy is classified. If two jets are pointing toward the sky, they are classified as a radio galaxy. However, if one of the jets is pointing toward us, the galaxy's AGN is called a blazar. With jets in the plane of the sky and one pointing towards us, PBC J2333.9-2343 has been reclassified as a radio galaxy with a blazar at its center. The team does not yet know what caused the drastic change in direction of the jets. They speculate that it could be a merger with another galaxy or another relatively large object. Another theory is a strong burst of activity in the galactic core after a period of quiescence. Scientists who have studied this galaxy extensively emphasize that they have never seen anything like it before. PBC J2333.9-2343 is unique so far. This galaxy, which is about 4 million light years large, is probably very old, and it's a wonder how such a galaxy builds up, devours large masses of energy, and wanders through space as a huge monster. The Threat to Our Solar System The jets are now also pulling the supermassive black hole at the center of the galaxy in our direction. And we have to wonder, what would come if PBC J2333.9-2343 migrates directly towards us? Would we be in danger? Dr. Lorena Hernandez-Garcia, a researcher at the Millennium Institute of Astrophysics, and a specialist on the galaxy PBC J2333.9-2343 says no. The black hole is incredibly far from Earth. Even if the supermassive black hole is pointed directly at us, its gravitational effects on Earth are negligible. And even if the entire galaxy is moving toward us, it would take billions of years for it to reach us. Black holes do not emit light or radiation that could harm us at that distance. A supermassive black hole pointed directly at Earth would certainly be a fascinating astronomical phenomenon to observe, but it would pose no threat to our planet. The Approach of a Black Hole to Earth While it's highly unlikely that a supermassive black hole would approach Earth, if it did, we would probably notice it soon. Let's just assume that such a dark supergiant is indeed coming toward Earth. In that case, the view from Earth would gradually change. At first, such a black hole would not look much different in the sky than a star. The accretion disk around the black hole glows as the hole sucks matter into itself. Over time, as it approaches us, we would find that the light from the stars that are behind the black hole is distorted by its immense gravitational pull. This phenomenon, known as gravitational lensing, would cause stars and other celestial bodies to appear to change position in the sky, when in fact, they would remain firmly in place. As the black hole gets closer, its gravitational pull would become stronger and stronger, which could lead to noticeable effects on Earth. The tidal forces of the black hole could affect the oceans, causing extreme tides and possible tsunamis. Earth's rotation could also be affected, resulting in longer or shorter days. Earth's atmosphere would also be affected. Radiation emitted from the black hole's accretion disk could ionize the upper layers of the atmosphere, leading to spectacular auroras much more intense than anything we have seen before. As the black hole gets closer and closer, its tidal forces would become so strong that they would begin to stretch and deform the Earth itself. This could lead to massive earthquakes and volcanic activity as the Earth's inner core and mantle are disturbed by the gravitational forces. Eventually, if the black hole were close enough, its gravity would begin to tear the Earth apart piece by piece. This process, known as spaghettification, would result in the Earth's matter being pulled into the black hole long before it actually came into contact with the Earth. During this entire process, it would be extremely difficult for life on Earth to sustain itself. The combination of increased radiation, gravitational disturbances, and the physical effects of the black hole's approach would likely cause many life forms to become extinct. The Interior of a Black Hole 
As you have now seen, if the black hole sucked in our solar system, we humans and all other living things would be long gone. In order to increase the goosebump effect still just a little bit more, we think to ourselves now, nevertheless, what would happen if you would fall into a black hole? We leave aside the fact that the hole would stretch your matter into spaghetti even before you cross the event horizon, that magical threshold beyond which there is no escape. Inside the hole, you would see for the first time what a singularity really is. This point, to which all matter that sucks in the hole is compressed, is a mystery to science. For a long time, researchers thought it was simply the end of all matter and all physical values that we know. But things are now looking a little different. At the singularity, our possibilities of measurability stop because all known quantities go towards infinity. However, this does not have to mean that nothing more comes there. On the contrary, it's much more probable in the meantime that at thresholds like these, new dimensions or even universes begin. Researchers have found that new universes can be born inside black holes and that even our own universe could have been created inside a black hole. Perhaps you would be drawn to a completely different world or realize completely new dimensions of our universe. Don't miss the upcoming top videos and press subscribe now.